Hey, what's up guys? How's it going? Today I want to go over how to draw a very uh, simple kind of flying saucer, you know? It's going to make it a very general shape. So I'm going to be using a pencil. It's not really that big of a deal. Uh, I, don't, I don't really... Uh, I'm going to think of kind of a saucer shape, obviously. Kind of a plate, an upside down plate. I'm going to try to do a very typical kind of... Uh... <coughs> Have a very typical version, nothing too too wild, but I do want to throw a little bit of design in there. I want to kind of match these up a little bit, but not totally. See, that's totally way off. So right now I'm basically drawing a diamond. And I want to make it look a little bit more like a flying saucer by... From here on, you know, you can kind of do whatever you want. You can just do maybe your own design elements. Um, I'm kind of doing this on the fly, so you're seeing me experiment right now. Maybe have a, a propulsion over here. I would look. All right. <clears throat> Let me get into it, and then uh, after the time lapse, I'm going to kind of go over what I was talking about. All right, <clears throat> I'm back. So for now, I got a general shape right there, and I also what I did was there's gonna be I want it to be slightly metallic, so the sun will be uh, coming from above, and I'm gonna put like this reflected light because it, it's it'd be in the sky, and there's gonna be a little bit of light down here, so I'm gonna put a dark band, kind of a core shadow they call it, right here. They're gonna show the bottom of this is in shadow. But it's not, you know, super, super in shadow. Because it's up in the air. I'm going to put a dark line down there. To just, uh, I like the way it looks. Around the contours of it. Uh, I, what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to put a little bit of gradation over the top of this. I put a door there. I'll, I'll mess with that in a bit. I'm going to put a light, really light shadow over the whole thing here. I'm going to rub it with my finger. You can do that with graphite. I go in here and I'm going to see if I can make this door look a little better. Or window or whatever it's going to be. Actually, I might make it a window. Yeah, I might make it a window. I'm going to try to make a reflection by... Doing that. Kind of putting a gradation here and then kind of a... shine over here put maybe a darker I'm fooling around I'm trying to see what would make something look kinda like a shine at least a reflection Kind of coming off odd, but I don't, I don't hate it. It's not that bad. It's all right. Yeah, it's kind of a reflected window there. To do the propulsion, uh, I'm gonna actually leave that part. I'm gonna make it more like a candle kind of wick upside down.
I'm going to leave that inside part almost completely white. And then kind of do some light shading around the outside. If I wanted to, I could shade in the entire thing black. Um, I'm contemplating doing that. I might do that. I think it kind of gives it a cool little feel. Kind of a classic image feel. Alright, I'm going to do that. I'm actually going to time lapse it and do it. So let me start that up. <laughs> 